what's up we're back with the gauntlet today um the wordle gauntlet wordle hurdle framed wordle wordle hodl um, all different types of wordle variants i'm gonna toss out wordle for right now because i want to keep these videos under 20 minutes long probably 10 to 15 if possible um, like comment and subscribe the first video is doing really well i'd like to see these ones do just as well maybe it's just about the content within them we'll see anyway moving on um as always, we start with the same words I always do. I want to try to keep the time down as much as possible, so we're, we're moving. Um, um, coral. <clears throat> Cow, that's the calabungus. Um, hmm. Hoops. There was no A, so that was absolutely stupid. Um, uh, C O Coil. Koa, collab. Coward. Hmm. What's good, Pettis? Coxy. I'm drawing blanks. Um, comma. Yeah, I just ended up seeing M, and then all of a sudden it was like, okay, yeah, I got it. Sweet. Hurdles. Who the hell is supposed to get it from that? Against Kong by Led Zeppelin. Okay. Um, when I was quickly getting all these up, um, I saw this picture, and it's ringing something. Wait, is this um the one with the fish, the the love story with the fish that I saw one time, and I hated that movie. Um, Guillermo del Toro. Um. Uh, something to do with a C. No. Um, sh oh, shape of water. That's my first guess. It's not the shape of water. Okay, we got a gun on the table and blood. This looks to be a little bit older than I would have thought from this picture. Hmm. Red light, bloody hand with a gun. 
this isn't necessarily ringing any bells at the moment. I think after you get through frame three, they become really easy. Um, he's got on a suit. Uh, um. Just submit. Yeah. All right. Jeez. Uh, they have that scene in uh, the Leonardo DiCaprio movie where they're. Jeez. Uh, this isn't really ringing any bells. Um, the scene in Shutter Island. Where, where he's got all the shooting. I think there's a train in that one. Oh. I got it. <laughs> all right. Cool. I really didn't think that was right, but we'll take it. Um, MLB guessing game. Okay, who do we want to start with today? Um, let's do Michael Conforto. Sweet. We got some good information here. So he's a right-handed bat. And the NL East. They seem to really like the NL East, so um, I guess that's good. Um, let's try a different team. So we have um, what's his uh, that dude that I hate that plays center field for Washington. For some reason that's in my brain. What about Josh Bell? Nope. Uh it was Victor Robles I was thinking of. Um, who else is in the East here? Or uh, NL East. Uh, Washington, Miami, the Mets, uh, Philly, Atlanta. Um, okay, we got Atlanta. He's right-handed. Um, does not play the outfield. Um, we're going to go with Dansby Swanson. No. Uh, it's not Ozzy Albies. Uh, Riley. Okay, he's, he's young. He could be a pitcher. Freed is left-handed. Is it only position players? Okay. So that can't be Travis Darno. I get a lot of heat for saying his wrong, name wrong all the time. Um, not first base, not right field, so it's got to be left, left center. Um, it's not Eddie Rosario. Duvall plays center for them, even though he's listed as right here. Um, I'm drawing kind of a blank here. Who's their other outfielder? Um, this might be a little bit old. There's no Jack Peterson. I mean, can't be Solaire. Yeah, he's... They still have him with Atlanta. Okay, he's also from the United States. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Um, Ian Anderson? Yeah, it was Ian Anderson. Okay, cool. Love to see it. Um, pitching makes it a little bit difficult, but that's not too bad. Um, Weddle. Who do we want to start with? Aaron Jones. 27 years old. Um, not in the NFC. Not a running back. Um, taller than 5'9". Let's go... Uh, who's who's a fun one we can do? Someone newly acquired someone. Uh, I was going to say Allen Robinson still in the NFC. Um, uh, ch -ch 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 -ch. AFC, AFC, AFC. Uh, 27. So I was going to say Jerry Judy. That's not right. Um, let's do. Let's go, dude. 
fucking Drew Lock, but he's he's in the NFC again. All these trades, man. I'm just trying to find someone random to put out there. Um, hmm. AFC North. Who would fit kind of this? I'm just going to put T. Higgins. Just because. Just for funsies. Cincinnati, wide receiver, under six foot four. Okay, so who else we got there? We got Chase, who's too young. Um, Tyler Boyd. Excellent. Um, we're going to try hard mode if Potal goes quickly. Um, we're just going to go with Middleton. Okay. Um, he's in the East, not the Bucks. He's a forward, below six foot seven. Um, so he's probably a small forward in the East. Um, who does that leave us with? Um, not in the Central Division. So, uh, Wendell. Let's go with Wendell. He's in the southeast, shorter than six foot seven, um, older. All right, we got a lot to work with here. So he plays with Miami, um, and he's older than 32. I'm getting all these old heads in this game. Um, under the number 22, under six foot seven. Um, all I can think of is damn it. Um, all I can think of is Duncan Robinson, Tyler Hero. Um, who else do they have at forward over there? They got Bam Adebayo. He's a center. Um, he wouldn't fit the criteria. He's not old enough. So good news. We learned he's younger than forty-one. Um, let me see that silhouette. He looks like he's got a clean dome. This man's just shaving head ass. Uh, does this guy get any PT? Very solid jawline. Um, hmm, I can only think of young guys. This guy must not... Like, what is his contributions to this team? Uh, man, these bench players kill me, bro. not Justice Winslow. I don't even know if he's with Miami anymore. Probably not. Um, so power forward or small forward. I'm really drawing a blank. Potal just kicks my ass. I would like to be able to get all of them. Who was the guy who tried to fight Jimmy Butler? On his own team? There was a guy who tried to fight Jimmy Butler on his own team? He looks like this. This rise with like a weird Shane Battier head. Wait, is it like a uh, name? I mean, the head kind of look ish, right? Um, I'm gonna name everyone on the team that isn't the right person. I didn't even think Duncan Robinson was that old. Uh, I mean, we got one, two, three, four. Uh, this guy must not play at all. It could be like even like a two-way D-League player. I've seen one of those on here, and it was just like, what the fuck? Um, um, apparently, I haven't, but I will see it soon because I know you'll send it to me. Thank you for that. Uh, is there any way to uh, I think I'm just I, I, I just accept the fact that I'm terrible at this game and need to brush up on my basketball players I really hope it's not like yesterday where it's um, 
Goran Dragic. That would be really sad. Um, who's the other uh, Tyler Hero representing uh, Milwaukee? Tyler Hero, six foot five. We learned that he's six foot five. That doesn't help me at all, though. Uh, I'm gonna put Porzingis as the last one. Oh no, Bobby Portis. That's cool. Pete. That is sad. I should have known that. This is the second time I've been finessed by a hometown player. That is... It hurts in this region where my heart is. It also kind of feels like indigestion. But that's okay. Um, uh, hard mode. Okay. We get 10 guesses. Let's start with AJ Green. It's not the AJ Green I thought it was. So it's in the AFC but not the North older than 23. Um, AFC West. Uh, I was going to put Juju, but that doesn't make any sense because he's old. Well, Juju's got to be older than 23. Right? Um, 25, not in the AFC West. So AFC South or AFC East. Not a wide receiver. Um, AFC South. Um... And he's short, so probably a running back. Um, Rex Burkhead, 5'10". Okay, so he's like in the AFC East. Um, who does that leave us with? That's Okay, so Patriots, like Brandon Bolden. Let's try Brandon Bolden. Oh, he's... He's no longer with the Patriots. That's awkward. Uh, James White. AFC East, five foot ten, exactly. Uh, he's a little older. Okay. Um, Ahmed. Um, what else we got in that division? The Jets. Oh lord. Um, I actually can't remember any running backs from the Jets. I know there was the young guy who had the breakout kind of shit. <coughs> um, I think he's too young. He was a rookie, though. Uh, so we have Singletary. Ooh. Ooh, okay, okay, okay. Zach Moss. Okay. Um, oh, I should have noticed he's not been a run running back this entire time. Who could be 5'10", I guess, and it's not a corner? This blows my mind. I didn't realize it was a... Ah, Carter. Thank you. Yes. Um, 25 in the AFC Buffalo is a corner. Or, well, he's not a corner. He's like a safety. It's got to be either a safety or that's pretty much it, right? Well, Micah Hyde isn't a corner, but okay. He's not going to be 25. What other... I mean, it has to be a safety, right? At 5 foot 10? Unless they got, like, a really short punter. No tight ends, no offensive linemen will be that short, no defensive linemen, linebackers. It's got to be a safety. And the only one I have is Jordan Poyer, and there's no way he's 25. Um, we're putting Jordan Poyer, and we're taking our shit, and we're going home. Tyler Bass. It's their fucking kicker. Okay, interesting. Well, this is going to keep that video at almost exactly 20 minutes. We hopefully have just as much success with this one as we do with the first one, which is up to like 40 plus views, which is pretty nice. We're getting a little bit more comments, which I like to see. Do that. Do that more often. Uh, give me some likes if you want, I guess. Uh, subscribe if you feel it's necessary. Um, if you made it this far, that probably is a thing you'll do. Um, otherwise, we are done. We're creeping up on 20 minutes. Also, Pettis, I want you to give me a list of 10 of your favorite movies because I want to watch them. Okay, three, two, one, and...